kids, welcome to my crazy life. It's Lori and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. Yes, I'm wearing the same shirt because I recorded my month review today as well. I've got some coffee, it's after work. The boys are settling in, it's storming out. Let me fix you. That's better. And yeah, I have a haul for you. Mm. Oops, let's not go spilling coffee on the carpet. I don't know if I have a lot or not. We'll see. But let's get started, shall we? Okay, I grabbed... Um, I know, I know. I said I wasn't going to buy them there anymore, but I was there. So I grabbed an orange, and my favorite is grape. So I grabbed three of these. I love them, especially for summertime. So I grabbed those for me. And then I found for Sarah... I'm sorry, Dollar Tree. Are we getting bougie? You have Kashi cereal? I know this is more than a dollar twenty-five. This is like four or five dollars. The good through date on here is June 1st, so she has plenty of time to eat that. And yeah, and this is just, I think this is their version of like Cheerios. So I will send that to my Sarah because she needs, you know, Cheerios in her life. I was, my Dollar Trees are still a little, I don't know. They don't have a ton of stuff still. That's okay. We don't need a ton of stuff, right? I have a bag over here so I can just toss the things that are going to go upstairs. I'm in the process of purging all my crafty goodness. Um, I picked up some of this gray chenille. It's definitely coming off lighter gray. It's a darker. But this is nice um, for finishing cross stitch patterns if you make like an ornament or something I love it and it's super soft so I grabbed one of those for that I found some of this now this is definitely nautical and I don't have a nautical theme in my house however I love navy blue and this could easily be untwisted and just use the navy blue so that it's not nautical but it will go with my boho theme so I grabbed three of these these are five feet long, so they're not super long, but if I untwist it like that, the blue comes apart and I have two separate smaller. So that's kind of what I was thinking when I bought that. Um, I picked up, oh, I got one of the, two of these. I love these, these are glass. They're calling it vase filler, but I'm not really sure what vase or how many of these you would need to fill a vase, but they're just, they're little sparkly diamond shapes. And then I, these are cream colored, which again, I love. Um, they have a little bit of a sparkle on the top, to them on the top mostly, but I think everywhere. So they're super shiny. And I thought these would be fun. And they almost look sand colored, but there's a little bit of sparkle to them. And I also thought these would be fun as like on the top of a plant, like a little succulent or something. I'm not sure, but I grabbed two packs because they were new and I needed to show them to you. Right? Right. Um, oh, these, they brought back the little stationery sets. So I grabbed one. I am forever sending out like notes and stuff. Thank you cards or mailing things to people. So... I just grabbed the one set. This set comes with two cards, four letter pages, pieces of paper, and six envelopes. So that's nice. So I grabbed that. I liked the pink. Um, I saw these, which is new. It's just the metal and it says welcome. Um, they also, I saw, had a rooster, a pig, a cow in this metal about this size. I thought that was really cute, but I'm going oh, there's Wellington for those of you who miss the boys. Dubby, Dubby, he's ignoring me. He's mad because see the rain. I made him come in. So I thought this was fun to hang on a wreath or something for the summertime. Um, also, this is going to be for outdoors because yes, I don't have a nautical theme, but I think this screams like summer 4th of July. And I don't, I cannot tell if this is wood or like plastic, but I really enjoy it a lot. And you can paint this any color you want, but I really thought it would be a fun, like 4th of July wreath, kind of nautical something to put out of doors for the 4th. So I grabbed that. 
Where are you going, buddy? Hi. You coming over here? Yeah, you want to come see the people? You want to say hi? He said, I don't want you grabbing me, lady. Did you say hi to the people? They missed you. Yeah. They miss you. Yeah. Okay. He's mad because I, I got handsy with him and grabbed him. I found the foot masks. I am telling you, I love a foot mask. These are moisture foot masks. Um, they also have exfoliating. I don't care for the exfoliating, but I love the moisture and these are lavender and I got the hand masks that match. So I grabbed two of that because duh. Um, I found the Carbona Stain Master or Stain Wizard Pre-Wash Stain Remover. And the reason I like it, it's gel, but it also has this scrubby thing. And I'm going to show you something else I hauled and I'm going to tell you what I use it for. But I grabbed this. I've heard good things and I was out of stain, stain stuff. Um, when you eat a keto diet, you eat a lot of fatty foods and I feel like I get it all over me. Um, hello, Dollar Tree. Again, who are you these days? So they're calling this a towel or tissue holder. I'm calling it downright fantastic. And it's a base. So if you wanted to put some more macrame on it, you totally could. You could put a bathroom towel on this. You could put anything you want. But it's everything. And for $1.25, absolutely not. This is worth, I mean, gosh, these wooden rings. And that is a wooden ring. If you want to strip this thing apart and make your own macrame, I say go for it. So I don't know what this is going to be used for but it's fantastic. And I did see them still at one of my Dollar Trees. Hi, buddy. Can I move you so I can get to my stuff? Yeah, you think that will be okay? This is what I'm talking about. I purchased this and I have one already and I'm gonna give this one to Sarah. So I use these in my laundry when I have a stain. I put Dawn dish soap, or I put some of this stain gel, but I just, because this is not harsh, it's not going to like um, tear your fabric or rip up or make a hole, but it's enough agitation to like get the stains out, especially like I get pet stains on my clothes or um, like I said, grease or coffee or whatever. I, I'm always spilling coffee, let's be truthful. So I know this is a face scrubber, but outside of the box, laundry. Using it to get stains out of your laundry. It's fantastic. So I'm gonna send this to Sarah. She'll probably laugh at me because I'm sure she doesn't scrub her laundry like I do, but I don't, I spend a lot of money on my clothes and I don't like stains. And I've been dropping things on me a lot lately. I'm, I'm keeping things organized here. I'm in the middle of a huge purge upstairs in my office. And I'm just trying to be organized. Um, I finally found at least these, the coffees. I got one for Sarah, one for me. The um, water bottle stickers. It says, it's always coffee time. Then you get a coffee cup. I love this one. That's probably going to go on my water bottle. And then the grind and the beans. So I didn't find the cats, but I did find the coffee one, which is one of the ones I was looking for. I know they have cats and dogs. If I see the them, I'll grab one for me and one for Sarah. Um, but I'm definitely going to stick these on my water bottle this summer when I dig my water bottle out. Have I said this or not, but we're not in any particular order here. We're just pulling things. Um, I grab these dog waste bags because I am loving, loving having these in my car for a small trash bag. Use it and throw it. I don't have a bag in my car all the time. I literally, if I use it, I take it with me back into, hi, back into the house that night or wherever and toss it. And these were adorable. They have little donuts and little succulents or cacti on them. And these are for my car. Orban Luna's here, but I think these are fantastic refills for those, um, the pink and the teal ones that I got that I keep in my car. I'm telling you, this was a genius idea. So I grabbed that. Then I grabbed these. And why, you might ask, they're, they're just calling them stirrers. And it's a pineapple and a cacti. And they did have 
the flamingo, but I didn't like the flamingo. This is what I like. You see that bottom scoop spoon like at the bottom to stir my coffee. I need something that like stirs my coffee. And for summertime, these are going on my coffee bar. As soon as I go wash them in some soapy water, and this is what I will use all summer to stir my coffee in the morning. Guys, look at him. And for $1.25, you get four. I don't think any household needs more than four, but I do. Because they were cute, and they'll go on my coffee bar. And maybe I'll share them with Sarah, too. Maybe she'll get two, and I will get two, because she has a coffee bar as well. Sarah is my niece. I forget to mention that. And she lives about an hour from me, 45 minutes. And she has Luna, the little dog that comes to my house on occasion. I have to say those things. We don't have much more to go here, kids. I'm really kind of, well, I guess maybe, I'm waiting on my Dollar Tree to kind of get some more fun stuff in. But it hasn't quite happened yet. Okay. In here, I grabbed these socks for my coworker's little boy. And these are uh, size seven to nine. So they fit shoe size 10 to four. And I believe he's in a two. So I grabbed these for her. These are regularly $4.99 a pair. And I got them for $1.25. And, you know, he has to wear tennis shoes to daycare. So he'll wear those. You know, he has to wear them every day. Now, for Sarah and I, I grabbed these. And I'll show you up close. This one I'm going to keep for me. What this is, it's for your makeup brushes. So when you're traveling... You put your makeup brushes in here. It keeps them from like becoming musty because this can breathe, but it also keeps them from getting all over everything else. I mean, I'm sure you could use this for anything. You could use it for pens and pencils. You could use it for crochet hooks, knitting needles. It doesn't matter what you put in it. But what I'm telling you it's for is makeup. Sarah's getting ready to go on a trip in July, so I'm gonna give her that one because she likes that color pink and I like this color pink, but it's mesh up here and it says, you're like really pretty. And they had them in teal and a purple, I believe. So I grabbed just the one for her and one for me because you know, we like to travel and this is fantastic for makeup brushes, especially if they, you know, if you just use it, it'll hopefully keep the makeup off of your other stuff. Right, buddy? Right? Yeah. Okay, um, I grabbed some silverware and I grabbed this specifically because it's more sturdy, I feel like, than some of the other plastic silverware. And I don't use plastic silverware a lot, but I'm going this summer to a couple picnics um, downtown in Columbus. Our symphony has, um, you buy tickets and you sit on the lawn or at a table and you bring your own food and alcohol or drinks or soda and you eat and you listen to the symphony play, different music. And so I needed some disposable. I did buy the wooden stuff, but I'm a little nervous for like splinters. So I thought, hmm. So I just grabbed these. Um, yes, it's a smaller pack than you can get. I know that. But what I'm more worried about is that these seem a little more sturdy than some of the cheaper ones. I mean, I don't need anything too. I don't need to bring real silverware, but I thought these would be perfect to take along on my picnics. And then even if, if I bring them home and wash them, I can use them more than one time, it's fine. That doesn't bother me. Right, Bubba? Um, here I got something to drink. I, I'm, this is a, a repeat purchase for me. And I'll tell you why. I got, at my stores, we have the Evian. This is mine. It's grapefruit and basil, and it is lightly flavored seltzer water. There is zero carbohydrates, zero sugar. It's spring water, carbon dioxide, magnesium sulfate, natural flavors, zinc, and sulfate. It's just a mineral water. There's no sugar or anything. I used it with gin the other night, and it was delicious. I just put a splash of gin in it. Every once in a while, I have a little adult beverage at night. I'm of age. Um, and this is six cans for $1.25. Thank you very much. I drank this just by itself one day too, but I was like, that would be delicious. Because if you don't know, I enjoy a gin and tonic. Tonic has sugar in it. 
it's a sweetened mineral water so I can't have that but this was a great replacement for me and this is the Evian very name brand so I I have drank two of the other ones so I have four and then this six and that'll get me through the summer not a problem I'll probably take a couple with me when I go up to the pool oh, bye bye when I go up to the pool okay you're gonna get up in your bed he is deciding if he's going to sleep on the floor in that corner beside the wooden bat, the wood basket, or if he's going to get up on the back of the couch. Those are his two night spots. All right, just a couple more bags. I picked up. Oh, I found these. These are. It's a dog bowl. This is not metal. It is plastic, which is what I wanted, but it has the rubber gripper on the bottom. So when Luna comes, the boys' um, wet food bowls that are more flat for the cats are too small for her. This is a good size bowl. She gets a little dry food, a little wet food. And so what I will do is run this to the dishwasher and then I will just keep it with the boys' bowls. And when she's here, then Sarah doesn't have to cart back and forth Luna's food bowl because... I mean, Luna is here enough, trust me, that that's not necessary. And this brand is Dolce Limonoso, made in India. But it's a cute, they had them in all different colors. You could totally feed your cat in here, but these are designed for dogs. And I like the high side to keep her food contained because girl can make a mess with her dog food, let me tell you, because she's so worried that those boys are gonna come and want her nasty dog food. And I just keep saying that they don't want your dog food. They don't want it. They don't want your bone and they don't want your dog food. You gonna take a nap? Dubby. You gonna take a nap? He said, yeah. Um, I grabbed a card. If you don't know, um, these are Hallmark cards. This is Hallmark Expression. And I don't know how much these are at the regular store, but it was $1.25. I have a baby shower this weekend. I also got a bag, a baby bag. So what I have learned or have been told, I don't know the, the validity, but Hallmark is in Dollar Trees if there's no Hallmark near them. So my one Dollar Tree, there is a Hallmark store in the same plaza. So they don't carry, they carry some of the cards, but they don't carry all the good gift bags. The other Dollar Tree I go to, there's no Hallmark nearby, and they do carry the good gift bag. So, just as an aside, um, I got some fabric, and this fabric is for a very specific reason. So, and thank you all who have donated very generously to my, my bicycle ride for Pelotonia, my fundraiser. And I decided that all the people that have donated to my ride are going to go into a drawing. I haven't figured out everything that's going in it yet. But I'm gonna make a bag, like a project bag, and I'm gonna fill it with goodies. And this is the fabric that I got. Isn't that perfect? It's bicycle, but not overly bicycle. It's more summery or spring. And then I will, and I love this like tealy color to it. So I grabbed two pieces of this. I would maybe line it with a yellow or something and then put a zipper on it and make it a padded zipper bag and that will be part of the giveaway for pelotonia no minimum donation is required um i have like two dollars one dollar five dollars it doesn't matter if you donate you are going to be in the drawing for this gift this bag and i will have a video separate just for that but I was so excited to have found, because I wanted some bicycle fabric, and I found some, and I love it. This is, And I'm telling you, this is not bad quality. This is better quality fat quarters than they sell at Joanne Fabric. I'm just going to tell you that right now. This is a nice quality. So I'm excited for that project. I need to sew the bag up, but that's, what we're, that's, that's how we're rolling here. Okay. Now, two more bags, kids. Two more bags. Speaking of Luna, I grabbed her one of these dental bones. Just an oral bone. It's a little big for her, but it'll keep her busy. Because she gets fussy with the boys sometimes, and they get fussy with her. So if I give her something to keep her busy, and I think she likes it. So it's just a dental bone for the dog. She can have it when she comes and visits Aunt Lordy. 
So I grabbed that for her. Um, they came back out with these Traveler's Notebooks. And I love this print. And if you haven't seen them, they have the two notebooks inside. And you can add or take away. And if you think you're going to use it a lot, but you really like one cover, you can buy other ones and then just, it's elastic. Just take out this notebook and replace it. So this may end up in the giveaway. I don't know. We'll see. But I loved that. I think it's so springy and summery. So I had to have it. So I grabbed that for me ish ish. Um, for house cleaning, I grabbed this. And if you have ceiling fans, you need this in your life. It is an attachment. Obviously, it screws onto the broom handle. It goes over the arms on your ceiling fan to dust them. Because I will tell you how many times a year I climb up on a chair or a ladder to get to my ceiling fan when I can just... I mean, for not deep cleaning, but definitely for like a weekly dust... And this is pretty sturdy, it's metal. So it's not gonna like bend out of shape and it's gonna slide in there and just rub the dust off. And this is, I've had one of these before and it certainly wasn't $1.25. Um, and then you have your hole here where your broom handle. So these are all interchangeable as well as with the gardening tools. They all go on the same broom handles. I will tell you a little fun fact. If you leave your broom from the Dollar Tree leaning up against your uh, garage door and your garage door goes down, it will bend in half. I I'm just saying. Because it's, it happened. I know. Why do we only have one of these? Uh, what's happening here? Oh, no, I have two. Um, I found these. I'm going to open them to show you. But I found these in with the nautical section. Again, I'm not doing the nautical thing at my house, but look at the garland. And more importantly, look at these wooden beads. These are little square wooden beads. I am so taking this apart and using these little beads for something fantastic. So I grabbed two, sorry for the crinkle, because I knew there wouldn't be a lot. It is, I think these are like, a foot long. I mean, these are not long at all, but it's plenty of beads. And if you are in the nautical thing, you do that. Leave your little boat, but you can paint these for literally any season or paint, don't paint them at all. They are perfect. Um, it just says wood beads garland. And this is like one of the first times I have found garland at any of my Dollar Trees. And like I said, it's about a foot long if you take out all the little um these boats but yeah we're gonna do something with these for sure so i grabbed two of them there was three on the shelf so i'm like well i'll take two and i will leave one for somebody else now i found some of these spice mixes or spices old bay seasoning if you are not um aware this is seafood seasoning and it's very popular in like the maryland area or any kind of really coastal it is so good on shrimp i take frozen shrimp spray it with a little um avocado oil frozen sprinkle it with a little old bay and throw it in a preheated air fryer and it cooks up and it's so good this is a traditional seafood seasoning so if you want to make like crab cakes or anything like that old bay we like it for $1.25 and these are resealable. And then I got the garlic and roasted herb grill master for chicken or whatever. But I like these little containers because they don't take up so much room in my closet because I might have a problem with spices. I love spices. So these are delicious. This would also be good on a vegetable, put it on some potatoes and roast them, broccoli, call it, whatever. It's good. So I just grabbed those two seasonings because that's the flavors that spoke to me. Now, I went to, oh, I got some socks. I already wore the Mickey Mouse, and then I got Minnie Mouse socks. Because I think they're adorable. Um, yeah, they fit me good. I like it, these brands. This is a four to 10. 
I wear an eight and a half to a nine. My foot is a little wide and these were plenty big on me, even to the point that they didn't like eat my shoe. My shoe didn't eat the sock, which is a problem. So these were plenty big on me. If you see this brand, it is the Disney brand. I already bought a pair from a coworker with the, um, that baby Yoda, the child. And these are for me, Minnie and Mickey. I must have a sock issue. some beauty products I just grabbed some of this new color BB cream I like this enough if I'm wearing makeup it's just a little bit of color this is light number one which basically is me um, for adult use only and it's just um, it's like a tinted moisturizer is what it is it's a BB cream just to even out my color however I've been using L'Oreal, no, Olay, maybe it's L'Oreal, I don't remember, but it's um, a retinol. During the day, I use a retinol cream with sunblock, and at night, I use a night cream, and it seems to have been evening out some of my, like, I have, like, red. I'm just very pale, and my skin gets very irritable. So, if I feel like I would like some foundation, I have that. Um, I found this brand, Titania, Titiana, Titania. It's a brand from Germany and it's a really nice nail file. I like a really good nail file. Um, and so, yeah, I stay away from the chic brand from Dollar Tree. They're, they're okay, but they don't last. So you like you use it once and then all the grit is gone. So I'm high of high hopes that this one will be a nice, just, you know, shaper nail. Come on guys, we gotta do things. We gotta be beautiful. I found, this is a, by Peyton, interlocking two-in-one balm, shower and bath, Yang, uh, Lang Lang and Cedar Citrus Scent. There's a shower balm and a bath balm, or you can put them together. So this is for the shower, that's for the bath. It says, uh, turn the shower, oh, for shower balm, turn the shower on and place your balm near the water to release fragrance. The bath balm, fill the tub and drop it in. So one is for the shower, one is for the bath. I don't know why I couldn't use a bath one in the shower, but whatever. I love a shower bomb. So I grabbed that to try, and I thought that the smell would be everything. So I grabbed that just for me. I found this Midnight Temporary Color Foam in black. So in case I decide I want to color my gray, I could do a little black swap right here where my gray is in the front. I don't know. I thought it was fun. I love this SGX New York City brand of products. They are fantastic. I don't know how we got so lucky to get them at the Dollar Tree, but these are great. And this says blue to black. So it's blue velvet. So it's a super dark, bluey black color. Thought it would be fun. And then this is from CoverGirl. We're going to open it. It is cruelty free. And I believe these are highlighters. It says clean, fresh. Yeah, it's a highlighter stick. Um, and I got opal because again, I'm very pale. Like I am very, very light, fair skinned. And due to all my sun is skin issues, I do not try to tan. Now I do buy some sunless tanner for my face so I don't look like I'm freaking dead some days, but yeah. That smells good too. You go, color girl. But it is, yeah. Oh, that's so pretty. It's a highlighter. I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it right here. And it's so smooth. Oh, I like that a lot. Yeah, we're gonna use that. And this is Opal Dreams. So it's light and it's got a pinky undertone, which will go with my skin. So I grabbed that just because I thought it was fun. Now, the last thing I got, which I think is so weird, and you all need to help me with this. This is, and why did I buy it? Because it's weird. This is from Cardinal Health. It is a disposable stethoscope, a pediatric stethoscope. I'm sorry, what? That's a Dollar Tree? And they're disposable. So they're like single, t I mean, this is single time use here, guys. Oh. Okay, 
Hello, hello. It works. Why? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Are we playing doctor? I don't understand, but I bought it because it was there. Now, Cardinal Health is here in Ohio, so I'm wondering if they just had a reason that they had to get rid of them, but it says pediatric stethoscope, single patient, plastic, light blue. But I'm going to keep it. Maybe I'll need to listen to the cat to see, ooh, to see if he's rattling. Except for he purrs so loud when I touch him that I won't hear him rattling. But I don't know. It was $1.25 and I bought it because why not? I don't know. So that's what we got for you today. We started on a highlight and we ended up on something very weird. All right, everybody. I hope you have a fantastic day and I will talk with you later. Bye.